Due to COVID-19, all hair salons in Toronto are closed until further notice. Last Saturday, my husband needed a haircut and we decided that I would cut his hair for him. And I have never had cut, I've never cut anyone's hair before. I've never even touched a hair trimmer up until then. So we went to Walmart and picked up a hair grooming kit. And on Saturday, I cut his hair. Let's take a look and let me know what you think about the hair salons being closed during this time and what you're doing when you need a haircut. Let me know in the comments below. This is the clipper I bought. It's the wall brand model 3170. It's $29 before taxes. I picked this one up because it uses number guide combs, which most YouTube tutorials are going to refer to. Some hair clippers have their own technology and they don't use guide combs. When I was at the store, I had to make sure to check that the box states that it's for human hair as there were beard trimmers that have very similar photos on their boxes. And if you're buying online, note that pet hair clippers also tend to look quite similar. This set I like because it comes with a hair trimmer that is useful for finishing the back of the hair. My goal for today is known as a fade haircut. I took these photos of my husband's hair after a professional haircut last year, so they're handy this time. Then I went onto YouTube to watch some more tutorials and here we go. If you're interested in a tutorial that I follow, the link is in the description box below. I don't usually read instruction guides, but thankfully I did because I realized I had to oil the blades first. For this haircut, I'm going to be using guide combs number one, number three, and then number two. But since this is my first time, I'm going to start off doing a longer fade using number three, number five, and then number four to familiarize myself using the clipper and gain some confidence. And then after that, I'll just jump right into it. Okay, 